Dorn Becker has touched so many more people than you realize. We called 911, and when the paramedics got there, they said they needed to get her to a hospital immediately. She recommended that we go over to Dorn Becker. The moment when we found out that the infectious disease specialist had figured out what was ailing her and that it would be easily treatable now that they've got it figured out, that was like the best news ever. We met a lot of people that we we're never going to forget about in our life. So I noticed how much the doctors and nurses did for other kids and I kind of wanted to help other kids in the future like they helped me. I was looking on YouTube and saw that people were doing lemonade stands. And I go, okay, and do what? Raise money. And then she said, they saved my life. I want to give back. We had a lot of neighbors and uh, community members from the school that had heard about what happened and showed up. Even though some of them live on the other side of town, they just drive right up and donate some money. I thought it was like unbelievable how much money I got and how much people wanted to donate. Everybody had like a story, like maybe their friend or their family. I realized like how grateful I am for their from hospitals and how much they actually do. The Credit Union for Kids, having been around for more than 30 years, have provided a baseline of philanthropic assistance that have allowed us to be a better resource for both our community and for the world. We literally, literally could not fulfill our mission without the support of both the Credit Union for Kids, but every like-minded individual who helps to support us. A little bit of money can help a lot. Anything that you can think of to help, no matter how far-fetched or how silly you may think or how small you may think it is, every last little bit helps.